go inside and if you want to close the door there you go you got your you got your safety all right not sure about privacy um actually yeah there's no privacy there's just really no privacy in here like you just sleep here and someone will watch you Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're back. A block board. I haven't done that in a little bit. I missed that. Wow. All right, so I'm going to be building a house inside the sauna today. It's been a little idea in the back of my mind ever since the update because, you know, enclosed spaces. Like, if you give me anything that has a roof over it that you can place in build mode, I'm going to try and make a house out of it. It's such a very interesting idea. It's just how do we go about it? So let's try it out. Um, my athletic skill is level 26 now, so I'm only four levels away. I only have four more levels to go, and it's exciting because now I have like all these things, which is great. I hit level 25, and I got myself a free sauna. So once you reach level 25 yourself, you get this too. Now, the thing with this, it's a two by two. There's not a lot of space to work with, and to be able to make it into a house, that's gonna be some work, okay? It's not even wall height. If you like place a wall next to it, it's like barely, it's just a little bit shorter. You can't exactly put a roof on it easily unless you use basic shapes, which I think I will. But yeah, we're gonna try and turn this into a house and make it functional, fully functional. I guess you can consider this a strange build. I'm gonna put it like right here though. We'll just do that. Okay, let me try putting a roof on it to make it feel like a house because we are not going to make it into a house where it's just flat like this. That we gotta, we gotta put like some wedges on this thing. Oh, you can't even do that here's what we do we do a two by two square basic shape and then we're gonna go ahead and just put this over over top this and then we can put obviously the um basic shape like we can make ourselves a little gable roof with this and we'll just do that and then copy this around okay there you go <laughs> now it feels like a house <laughs> not really i don't think i want it to be in this should i keep the original color just because like original color and then i actually kind of want to make the sauna like dark taupe because normally in my brain i don't know why i just think when i think of a sauna i think of like dark taupe or something or like brown and it looks more cozy i don't know it gives me a more warm vibe and the lights oh you can change the lights inside that's really cool i don't know why i didn't notice that before okay i want to turn the steam off hold on let me turn the steam off it's a little distracting let's uh okay i turned off the lights and then it also turns off the steam okay now how do we make this a functional house four things we need to take care of hygiene fun hunger and um energy we're gonna place a structural we're gonna do a little vertical plank here that way we can attach a shower because i feel like this little area right here could be like a bathroom and then maybe i could put like a tv on this wall right here how am i gonna make food well we'll see i can put a mini fridge you can fit a mini fridge in here easily like that there you go and put a shower a little wall shower on this thing Perfect. And then you can have a shower right there. Doubles. Okay, you can like shower over these little rocks. <laughs> the steam rock. Um, now we need a bed. Well, technically we don't really need a bed because sitting down gives you energy anyways. But we definitely could put the bed up here. I don't think we should put like a full on bed. Because this little elevation, this level right here could be a bed. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe I'll put the bed here. I want to put the bed up here, but it sticks out of the sticks out of the box. And it's just, what is that? You know, what is that? But if I put it here, there's no problems really with... Okay, well, a little bit. We'll do that. We'll put a sleeping bag there. But we have hygiene. We have energy. We have somewhat hunger. But I feel like I still want to have like a proper kitchen in here. Okay, I, I changed my mind about where I want the TV. Maybe I could put the TV like... And then I kind of want to put a carpet inside. Can I do that? No, I can't. Of course not. Well, I will be able to just... As long as you have basic shapes, anything is possible, okay? As long as you have basic shapes, advanced placement, and like... <laughs> the Transform Plus Game Pass. Anything is possible these days. So I'm gonna put a little basic shape down there. A carpet over this, because I want a carpet. Although, I have a shower thingy right there. Well, the shower won't make that much sense. <laughs> Wait, can I just like, can I do that? There you go, okay. So you don't see the drain. I use the leaves texture a lot, or like the flower texture a lot for the rug. Do I do that again? We could do it. Let's just make it like white or something, I don't know. Everything is brown. Let's change some colors, guys. I, I think we should do that. But so far, I feel like this is going all right. Like, it's it's, it's okay. Let's just do red. Red plaid. Because it's giving me lumberjack vibes for some reason. So I'm just do this. This counter here. I'm not too sure about this. Maybe I can place another basic shape. Like a level. Like an elevated flooring sort of thing. Like, there's, there's so much going on with this. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make this like elevated. Can I have like a, a platform right here? I'm just gonna give myself a little platform to have counter space and stuff. Yeah, there you go. Little platform. And then underneath this, I'll have support for this platform. Okay, we'll just build li this little thing right here. We're adding on to the sauna. 
yeah, you you probably were thinking, oh, he's gonna just add a bunch of he's gonna add a bunch of different saunas together. No, I'm not buying multiple saunas. I'm just gonna put everything in one sauna, and that's it. <laughs> that's all I'm gonna have. Yeah, I want to have a little platform where I can stand and then have some counter space to work on. So, oh gosh, I just realized the counter is. Uh, I built many tiny houses, and I've I kind of you know I'm kind of growing to know where to place some stuff. We have a fridge. We have counter. We don't even have an oven. Like where where. Where is the oven gonna go? I need an oven in here. The bed right here, I sleep under the oven. That's not safe. <laughs> That's not very good. A microwave. I'm gonna put a microwave underneath the bed. That's probably what I'll do. Blend in, you know. There you go, microwave. Oh, it's kind of... It's very compact. This is super compact. But it's, it's, it's gonna be functional, okay? Okay, here's my thing. We're not gonna be able to cook like a gourmet meals. We have a microwave. Maybe we could um just have like some appliances to help out with the other things. If we don't have a full-on stove and such, that's fine. We can make microwave meals, <laughs> dinner, TV dinner meals. And actually, I think I might put a sink in here. You know, I'll put a sink in there because we still technically can make food within the sink. Just have to click on the counter. I mean, we technically could just make full-on meals. We, As long as you don't need a stove for whatever food you need to make, then we're actually still fine. It's all good. Okay, what about a toilet? We don't have a toilet in here. Let's do a little outhouse. Yeah, let's, um... Oh my gosh, I forgot a toilet. Change the counters. I'm using the counter with the um shelf inside of it. Yes, that's this is much better. Can I put the I can still do this. Okay, cool. And then I could put the I could put the <laughs> that's gonna look so funny. Anytime you turn on the lights in the sauna, it gets it will get steamy. So I'm gonna have some ring lights instead. Just to light up this little box that we're living in. I don't have to turn on the steam. Okay, the toilet, I will just make maybe an outhouse or something. Even though I I wish I could put it inside. Sometimes things are just not possible, okay? They're just not possible. I feel like this could be a nice little, like, decorative add-on piece, you know? We can blend it in to make it fit with the, uh, the house. We have ourselves a place to sleep. Place to grab food and prepare food. Um, don't mind that. There's a little microwave in there, too. That's great. I can put a blender here. That's fine. Blender. The kettle can go there. And then maybe I can have some, like, clutter stuff. Maybe some plants. I feel like plants would still be able to... We'll be able to put those plants in there. Yeah, this is nice. Okay. I don't, I don't know what that is supposed to achieve. Oh, <gasps> we should put some solar panels on this thing. Then it would be pretty efficient, wouldn't it? Like, let's do these um sun smart ones. Yeah. Why? Why? Why don't they like adjust? Hello? Okay, I'm gonna put it in here. How do I landscape this? This will be the fun part is trying to landscape it. Okay, I actually want to put some effort into it. Um. The only method I can think of is just like putting a bunch of trees around it because it's just such a just small little area. Probably tons of ways to actually go about the landscaping this. Kind of want to put a waterfall behind it for some reason. I don't know. I said I was going to put some effort in this. Hold on. You don't see it right now. But uh, okay. I just think the build itself, like the, the actual thing itself is very plain. I need to add some stuff to this. Nothing's working well because I think the build itself needs a bit of work. The more detailing. So we're going to add some pillars in the corners. Okay, we'll do that. We'll put some structurals on it too. Put in planks. A little roof trim of some sort. Now nah, this tree's in my way. This tree's in my way. Move over. Move it over. Okay. Oh gosh! Okay, I need to move the pillars in. That's- Okay, wait. I'm on to something now. I knew. I knew I had to do something with this thing overall. Like, I had to. Okay. I'll do this. I don't know. That's helpful. Sure. Sure, why not? Okay, move the tree back. That's a little bit better. And then for a dining table, I mean, we could have that outside. Do like a mini dining table out here. I'm gonna stick that in the corner of this hedge, sort of. Ooh, I love, I love it. It's great. Just grab two chairs, you know, keep it, keep it very, very simple. Um, yeah, let's just use simplicity chair and just kind of texture that. You know what? We'll have a grill because we are just that cool. Okay, we're that cool. Should I have a picnic basket too? Because I can totally do that. Look, it's giving me like camping vibes, okay? It's like kind of a camper vibe. Oh, we do need a dresser. So I will put that right next to the outhouse or something. I'm just gonna put a locker. This is very random. I'm just gonna put a locker out here. Yeah, because we have enough clothing to put inside of that. That's fine. And for fun, I'm just gonna add protein powder. I feel like I'm missing something. I think I need to put those trims up here too actually okay i'm actually gonna put like a welcome mat like right here just gonna do it 
Oh, you know what? Maybe I could like grow strawberries out here instead or something. We don't need flowers. How about strawberries? <laughs> Strawberry plants. We're self-sufficient. We grow our own strawberries. Combine some of like the outdoor stuff. Okay, you know what? That's cute. That's that's good. Oh, maybe a little garden noob as well. Just a little buddy there to watch over things. Yeah, there we go. I really am just adding these random things. Okay, wait, last thing. I just need path lights now. So garden lights, upscale light, path lights. If you're out here and you need to use the bathroom in the darkness um, when it's nighttime, yeah. It's time for string lights. Time for some string lights on this thing. Just to finish it. The cherry on top string light. Oh, wow. And I'm gonna put on the bush. <laughs> yes, the bushes will survive this. They'll, it would be perfect, okay? It's, man, I'm about to put the fridge back over here. Okay, we're swapping some places. Okay, and we put the fridge, like, and I'm moving that TV back here. Okay, that's much, much, much better. Much better. Okay. Okay, guys, here it is. It's officially done. My sauna house, I glammed it up, made it look like a house. Um, made a little add-on. It's fully functional, has place to sleep place to cook some food we can watch tv in here if we need some entertainment there's a shower a working shower and an add-on outhouse you have a little locker outside to change clothing um we have an outdoor dining table um and yeah it's it's really really nice i'd say um landscaping <laughs> it's okay i just put trees everywhere i that's something that will probably not change too much i just it's a small place it's a small little area go inside and if you want to close the door there you go you got your you got your safety all right I'm not sure about privacy um actually yeah there's no privacy there's just really no privacy in here like you just sleep here and someone will watch you at least it's closed and um i think it locks so you'll be safe not very much though um <laughs> if you want to take a shower you can take a shower right here uh the bet you know you'll get a little bit of the the sleeping bag a bit drenched but that's okay and then you can sleep right here very fun i love that if you want to just sit down up here as well you can um you can sit on the bed it looks like you're sitting in the bed watch some tv and then if you want to cook some food, you can do that as well. So if you want to make like a nice quick meal or something, you know, we love some frozen meals. Just put that in the microwave, pop that in the microwave. That works. If you want to make yourself a nice little salad, you can do that too. You can use this table even to prepare it. It's perfect. I don't know. So um, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cancel that, but I just want to show you, you can prepare food. As long as the food doesn't require a stove, you can prepare it. Okay, that's great. Yeah, and I have a little platform here to even just like stand and work on the, the counter. And then outside we have just a few little random things. We have a locker. Here is your little outhouse. Oh, I forgot toilet paper. Okay, I added a few more things out here. I added a little mirror so you can like pose in here if you want to. Like, you know, just pose in the mirror. Okay, then the bathroom is a bit more complete. So we have toilet paper and a shelf for supplies and a plunger. So we're actually super prepared. But yeah, it's just only a place where you need to use the bathroom. That's it, nothing crazy. And of course, yeah everything you need outdoors and that is my take on building a house within the sauna and kind of glamorizing it kind of making it a little bit more functional just a little bit more functional and if, if you wanted to actually like you know use the sauna there you go you can just a little bit hot just a little bit heated in here but that's okay everything is um waterproof and steam proof if that is a thing yes but yeah, that wraps up today's video of my sauna house. Um, I think I like it. I think it turned out pretty well. Um, and yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. It's completely free. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! This turned out pretty well. I was always wondering, like, how am I going to do it? How is this going to be possible? But I think it looks great. This is awesome. And it's kind of like a mini mood station, you know? Like, everything's together if you need it. Yeah.